Greetings, this is this, and I am me, and look, there's a bunny! Um, we're back here in this lovely little uh, makeshift escape room game thing happening. And I, there's how many bunnies? Six? One, two, three, four, five. Okay, yeah, I think there's six bunnies, and we don't know the frogs. Two badgers and nine for fancy cakes. That's what we figured out last time. And now we need to go and figure out where to use this candle with something to do with frogs. Um, because that's the last number that we need to figure out the combination on that lock, on that box, in there. So that's what I'm going to do. Um, I don't think it's anything down that way. I went down there. There was nothing down there. I couldn't go that way. They wouldn't let me. And this note on the candle said, use this to clear up your tunnel vision. So I'm assuming they're talking about me in that foggy area that I couldn't see anything in, which is down this way, I believe. We're just jumping right into it, guys. Yes, down here. Um, can I use, oh, I have so many things in my inventory. My lit candle. That candle is lit. Oh, look, I even have the clue. Clue number one, this light will help you clear up your tunnel vision. Well, I can't, they're not letting me use the candle. They're not letting me pick it or hold it or anything. Look, I phased out that memory for a reason. It's not important for this story. Okay, but what about going more south? Oh! Oh, I could just walk through here. They just He just wanted me to stop the section that went over to Pilar. So I can go down here. Oh, and I was, thought I was waiting for something to load or whatnot, but I was just here. Hey, guys, remember me? Wow, takes me back. So, yeah, there's a frog over there. What do you want me to do about it? Using the candle won't help me. Oh. Oh. Okay, so I don't know what the candle's for. We'll get back to that. So basically, it's either one for the one frog that's left over and didn't hop away, or it's one, two, three, four, five, six for the six frogs that are here right now. I think it's one, though. Because that one frog didn't hop away, and then when I go and stand over on that dock, it's all like zooms in on the one frog. Okay, let's see if, let's see if we've got this. Do -de 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 do 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 Okay. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Okay, here we are. Let's see if first time's the charm. We're gonna go with six, one, two, nine. Six. I thought I was going the faster way. I didn't know it was going to go like that. Okay, six, one, two, nine. And click. Crud. Okay, is it six? I'm going the wrong way. Is it six, six, two, nine? No. Is it six? Five two nine. No. All those other ones are definitely right. There's six bunnies. And there's a two on the badger picture. And Mr. Fancy Cakes weighs nine. Bunny, frog, badger, Mr. Fancy Cakes. What's the problem? There's one, two, three bunnies. That's definitely a fourth bunny over there. You can't can't see it when the camera's like that, but you can see it when the camera is like that. Well, see right there. One, and that one is two, and that one is three, and that one is four. And then there's one over here. That one is five. And then there's one over here. That one is six. There's six bunnies. Oh, seven. There's seven. See? One right there that I didn't count before. Okay. 
Make that seven bunnies. Hello? Set wrong way. Seven. And this can go back to one. First time wasn't the charm. Let's see if second time's the charm. No? Okay. Is it one six? Is it one or seven six? Is it seven five? Crud. Well, what else did I get wrong? Do I count this bunny? Is this bunny included? Can I click on this bunny? No. Wait, wait, wait. Go back up here. Can I go behind here? Nope. It's as if there's an invisible wall. Oh, is there more clues behind here? Oh, no. <sighs> Crud. Um... Favorite abstract art. Can't quite recall what the picture looked like. I can't quite recall what the picture looked like. Yeah, um. Orange. orange. See, there's a swoosh in the middle of that picture. One, two, three, four, five, six. But there's six badgers in the picture, I suppose. But that's not it, because they literally so make a number. Pink. See, and then that's the bottom of a two. And then if you look at purple, that's the top of a two. All three of those together make a two. Wait one sec. I don't get it. I don't get it. Woo! Woo! Okay. Well, then... What do you want from me? Because I figured this puzzle out perfectly. Mr. Fancy Cakes is... Okay, wait. If I put one of those, and one of those, and one of these, I level that out perfectly to eight. So that means it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And so this is... One, two, three... Four, five... Six, seven, eight, nine. Perfectly balanced. Mr. Fancy Cakes is nine. Seven, one, two, nine. Why isn't it working? I guess I can go and try to do something with the candle for now because I don't know what to do with the puzzle. But it's rather frustrating because I feel like I did that right. And sometimes in this game, when I do things, it's a case of, yeah, you did that pretty much exactly right and you were on the complete right track, you just did one tiny little thing wrong. And then other times it's, yeah, no, that wasn't right at all, you were completely, I don't know what you were thinking, you were crazy. And I never know which time it is, so... Um, but let's... I have a candle now, so is there some place I can go with this candle? Some place I can try to clear up my tunnel vision? That not the floating islands, it would... Oh wait! But I want to go over this way. Because this is where I was supposed to use the fruit picker last time. So let's see if there's any reason to use it over here now. No, I don't think so. But I do think I have to put my commemorative plates on here. I can't remember if I tried it last time. Ah, I didn't. Okay. Yes, perfect. Um, I'm assuming I'm just going to turn them all upright. I don't have number the second one. So will I mess it up if I put the third one on now? Possibly. Can I take it back off? Okay. Wait, is that going to give me instructions to do something? Or is it just completing the picture? I always thought it was just completing the picture. They're all lined up. They line, they all line up on top of each other. But there's like letters 
the arrows are going to be pointing to. So like that arrow is pointing to an R and then that arrow is pointing to a letter that I'll get once I get the last plate. And then Graham's pointing to a letter. It's pointing to the P. Interesting. I'll just leave that other plate there for now because I can always just pick it up and move it when I get the last plate. Oh, I don't want to go this way. That's the floating island. Nothing I can do over there right now. Can I use the candle over here? The lit candle? No. Well, what do I do then? Tunnel vision, tunnel vision. Maybe there's a, uh, air, maybe there is an area that I did not explore as of yet. Oh yeah, this creepy scary forest. Where's that? Oh, I kind of thought it was up that way. Apparently it's not because I just went up that way. <laughs> oh, it's over this way maybe. Or did I just come from this way? Oh, no, it's not that way. Where's the scary... Scary forest near Pilar. Where's that? It's hard to keep track of all of the different areas and whatnot now because everything's different. It, like, everything looks different. So I'm confused. This is the town, right? And there's no way I can go over there. Um, and then I just get back to over here. Where is the part that would take me through the brambly whatnot forest of doom? You know what I'm saying? It's not over this way. There's nothing over here. I was just over here. This isn't where I want to be. I want to be at that other spot. Maybe it was over that way? But I can't even go that way because the bridge is... The bridge is out, and I can't click on this. What was over... Oh, I think maybe it was over that way. Well, I guess I can't go to any of that area. I suppose I might be able to try going further south over here, though. Is this the spot with... Okay, yeah, this is the spot with the bush. And then I can go down. Oh, that just takes me here! <laughs> What do I do? I thought I had it all under control. I can't click on anything anywhere. Let me over there. Can I get over there from the other side of the bridge? Can I click on this little wagon? No. Can't click on any of this stuff. Can't do anything. I have to figure out the puzzle. But how? Wait, I can go over here? Dude, I didn't know that. Okay. Let's make, it, make our way downtown. Come on, make your way downtown walking fast. Faces pass and you're homebound. Fine. Well, I don't know why they let me look like I can go those ways when I can't. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven bunnies. How? Wait. What's this? Oh. Dude, why are you having the eye show up right there? Um, why can I walk all the way back over here? There's no reason for that. So there's seven rabbits. There's definitely seven rabbits. Now the other thing I'm thinking is maybe the badger up here is like black or maybe purplish. And then the badger in the picture is purple. That's why I initially thought hmm. I be purple. This wrong. But then if you click purple, you get a new picture. You get that picture. But am I supposed to be looking at what that number is? That still looks like it would be the start of a two. Is that a one? No. Two, yes. Three, no. Four, no. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Maybe it's an eight. Part of an eight? 
And there's eight badgers on the picture. Wait one sec. I guess we could try eight. Um, here we go. Seven, one, eight, nine. Ah, crud. What about seven, six, eight, nine? What about seven, five, eight, nine? Okay, what about, um, what is this for? The bunnies. What if the bunnies is actually, I'm going the wrong way. What if I'm supposed to count the one in the picture as well, so it's actually eight bunnies. Okay, and what if the frogs is six frogs? Okay, what if the frogs is one frog? Okay, what if, what was this for? The badger. What if the badger is actually still just two? And we have eight bunnies. I'm literally trying all the combinations I can think of. Six frogs, five frogs. <sighs> okay, we'll put that back to seven bunnies and we'll put this back to one frog and two badgers. Okay, because that's still what I'm most confident in. Are we sure they're showing us a new bunny right here? Yeah, I think they definitely are. This bunny is way over here. And when I look over here, I'm looking forward to a clearly new bunny that you can't see any way else. Maybe I'm supposed to take the candle back into the tunnel, but I don't understand why, because the tunnel had lights in it from the lighting project that I did, or whatever I called it, you know. I lit up the tunnel so you didn't need a candle anymore, but it's saying that the light will clear up my tunnel vision. What do you want from me? Unless, <laughs> I suppose one last thing I can try before I go all the way over the tunnel I will try to use the candle when I'm standing in front of the painting and see if it will like clear up my memory or something. So I can't use the l candle in front of any of the bunnies or anything. And the scale thing, I'm pretty positive that's nine. I don't know what else hmm. it would be. Didn't mean to click on that. This wrong. Um, never mind. Okay, here and the lit candle. Still can't do anything with it. Fine, fine. I'll go back to the tunnel. Okay, let's, well, first let's try the grabby grab over here. Doesn't work, okay. That's just where tri you can see Triumph's plate. Um, okay. Let's try using the candle in this part in the middle of the tunnel right here where you can look at this hole. Oh my god, it is right here? Okay. Well, what have we got? Yeah, what is it? It's just lines to me. I can't read it. If this puzzle has you trapped, use this shovel to dig up the answer. Oh, I know. I know where to do it. I know this part. I know this part. I know this part. I know this part. Yay, yay, yay. Yay, yay, yay. Me. It's over here. Um, I, I, I'll show you. Just wait a second. I'm getting there. Hold on. Hold on. It's right here. There's an X. X marks the spot. Uh, shovel. Yay. Okay, what's it going to be? I don't know how many clues there are. It just says clue number one, clue number two. It doesn't say out of. What have we got now? It's always knife to meet the pun king. That's scary. What do I use that on? A pumpkin? 
Pun King, Pumpkin, kind of sounds the same. Let's try it, even though I couldn't click on any of the pumpkins. What else could I possibly use it for? Um, it's always knife to meet the Pun King. I mean, that kind of sounds like pumpkin. So I'm assuming that's kind of what it is. Now, this was in the escape room, the first clue is where this all started. But does this stuff have to do with the escape room or is this a separate little task that I'm doing? I don't know. Okay, uh, pumpkin, I mean knife. Dude, just slice right into that guy, carve it up. A fishing rod, okay. Oh, I made a happy little face. I've always wanted to try fly fishing before I croak. Okay, so obviously we're gonna, that pumpkin is so cute. Obviously we're gonna go down to the frogs. Um, don't mind this area of my brain. It's fine, you know, I just whited it out a little bit. I wanted to brighten up the space, really, so... I mean, that's what I did. I brightened up the space. Let's use our fishing pole. Ah, so peaceful. What have we got? And... <laughs> that was the sound of the fishing pole flying out. I needed to catch this frog? I didn't just need to know the number? Of frogs that were there? What? Hey dude. How you doing? You have a number on you. Mm. Oh. Couldn't I have seen that from where I was though? I was looking at your back. Not me the player. Me, Graham. Cool. Okay, whatever. Eight. That's that then. That was fun. I enjoyed doing that. We had a grand old time. Um, so now I think I can open that box. So we're gonna go with six bunnies. Uh, eight frog, two badger, and nine fancy cakes. This is not the right way, is it? This is the rose. Yeah, okay. The rose garden is over that way. Not where I wanted to go. Sorry guys, my memory's failing me. I'm old. Very, very old. This is the way that I wanted to go. Thank you so much. See you, see you when I see you. And good night. That was the comedian leaving the building, not me. What am I talking about? I don't know. Let's just open this chest. And we're gonna get a key, I'm assuming, inside of it. Oh yeah, that's what Graham said was inside of it. Seven. Eight, two, nine. Yes! Green key! Perfect, I got an achievement, escaped elder. The elder scrolls. And close shut the jaws of oblivion! Frog with the number eight written on her back. Do I still need that? Or was that just for my memory? I don't know. I've got two keys out of four. I need the commemorative plates. And I need... Um, the key near the goblin hole thing. Um, <laughs> but I think we're going to leave those for next time. Um, I think it might have something to do with the fruit picker to get one of those. I'm not sure, because they're both high up. Maybe I can reach one of them. But yeah, we'll leave that for next time. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next episode. Or maybe I won't. I don't know. Maybe you're not going to come back. <laughs> but thank you so much for watching. I've said that a million times. Bye bye now.